down to crunch time, mastering the moment. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel, where we explore the fascinating world of English language learning. Today, we're diving into a phrase that's all about pressure, deadlines, and the final push to achieve something, down to crunch time. Let's unravel the meaning behind this phrase and how you can use it to express urgency and importance in your conversations. The phrase, down to crunch time, refers to a period when there's a heightened sense of urgency to complete tasks or objectives as the deadline approaches. It's that critical moment when there's no time left for procrastination, and every second counts. The word, crunch, here symbolizes the pressure felt to finish tasks, much like the pressure of crunching down on something hard. While the exact origins of the phrase are somewhat unclear, it's widely used in various contexts, including sports, business, and education. In sports, crunch time describes the final moments of a game when the outcome is decided, and in business or education, it refers to the intense final efforts needed to complete a project or prepare for an exam. The term captures the stress and intensity of trying to meet tight deadlines. Understanding how to incorporate down to crunch time into your conversations can help you express urgency or comment on the pressure of impending deadlines. Here are a few examples. We're down to crunch time on this project and everyone needs to give their all. With exams next week, it's down to crunch time for studying. The team realized it was down to crunch time and focused on finishing the game strong. Using the phrase in various situations will help you sound more like a native speaker and convey the urgency of the moment effectively. And that wraps up our exploration of the phrase, down to crunch time. We hope this video has shed light on how to use this expression to talk about critical moments when pressure mounts and deadlines loom. Remember, mastering these phrases will not only enhance your English vocabulary but also help you navigate conversations with greater confidence. Thanks for watching, and we look forward to bringing you more insightful content. Stay motivated, and see you in the next video.